Good morning, everyone. It's Joker. And once again, I am late to the party because they want to drop content on days that I have to work nights. So here we are, hours late to the Heroes Jubilee. <sighs> it is what it is. We are here now. I have not... This is the first time opening the game. Had to wait for all the updates to do. Had to download from the Play Store. Wait for the update on the actual game side. Now here we are, starting out. I have not looked at any videos. I have not looked at any strategies. We are going to go into this blind just with the knowledge that we need to use a dark team. And that is it. First, let me check my parallel process, see if I got any hammers. Hammers. Ha Ooh. You know what? I'll take those hammers. All right, and four light cores, even though I don't have Gazel Dwargo still. So all these light cores just waiting, waiting for the day I pull him, or whenever the light meta comes around, I will have plenty. Um, can, can I see how many I have? Is that a thing? It's not. All right. Okay. Heroes Jubilee from the menu. I'll, I'll worry about those later. Here it is. Heroes Jubilee. Four days. And I... Mm, I really don't care. Okay. Oh, okay, so it's laid out just like the normal stuff. Total milestone rewards. So there's five, there's ten, there's summon tickets. I think they're just basic summon tickets. Oh, okay, so you get ten from this, and then if in the shop do we exchange those there? N no? No? Are we... Wait. If I click the ranking, reward... 450 crystals? Ooh. Yes, yeah, so I have no ranking, obviously. I have not played. I guess... Because we need, what, 20 points to get Millen? And they're giving us 10 here? There must be a mission or something. I don't care. Let's go into here. Normal battle, beginner one. Let us use my decked out dark team. Let's... I don't need Rimuru here. We're going to do enough damage. So we have Beretta, Millen, Benimaru. Do I need Shion? What does Shion do again? Is it better to have Diablo or Xion? Because she doesn't... No, she doesn't change. Well... No... We'll put Diablo up front. Yes, that is what I want to do. We're going to equip all for attack, see if it actually gives me what I want. That's not what I want. That is what I want. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. <laughs> okay, whatever. Okay. Alright, 276. Is that really all we have? I thought we would have more. Okay, so we have Milim for... <laughs> She's level 100. I'm, I'm not, not going to use her. She is my pride and joy of this game. Bread is 84. Free to play Benny Mario still is a fantastic unit, being a free to play six star. Diablo is here just for his orb changing. I know it only changes like one or something, but whatever. Bread is the main orb changer, and then Veldora is here to boost my ultimate, if we even get to that point. Okay. Well, I don't suppose these first battles are going to be very difficult. No, oh, just one person. No, oh, this won't be hard at all. You're just gonna die. I'm just gonna change these orbs and you're gonna die. Right?
<laughs> you might die in like the first two hits. But you're just dead in the first hit. All right, cool. Oh. Oh, there's three fights. I need to read butter, don't I? My mom's gonna kill all of you. And who's gonna kill all of you? Yes, all right. First battle, done. Obviously not very hard. It's only a 30,000 EP rank. So. I didn't look at the scores. I didn't look at the scores! Whatever. Normal battle beginner two. EP 80,000. I think we'll be okay. I think we're going to survive. Just a feeling. This is only one fight, though. Okay. So we're gonna do that. And you're all gonna die. Ooh, you, oh, you survived, wow. He took three hits before he died. More than I thought he would take. But not you. You had that 110% damage from Milim. You don't need a lot to get tapped out. Damage inflicted, turn bonus, survivor score, maximum points. All right, 100 of the currency, one ticket for the boss. Unlocked Heroes Jubilee normal. Okay, cool. 100,000, ooh, we made a jump, didn't we? No, we didn't. It's like 80,000 to 100,000. All right, so this seems, unfortunately, it's nothing groundbreaking. We've seen this in Sword Art Online, um, Alicization, Rising Steel, or Unlimited Blading, or whatever they rebranded themselves to. Um, you play a bunch of little fights, you get tokens or some sort of currency where you can fight the boss and the boss drops better stuff. It's just how it goes. It's nothing revolutionary. But what I really, really want to know is will I be able to grind this tonight and get Space Millum tonight? Because I don't want to wait for no ranking rewards because this is going to be up for four days and then the in-game message said it's going to take a week until we get those rewards from this. So we won't get it until not next Tuesday, Wednesday, but the Wednesday after. Like, the Wednesday of thanks or Christmas week is when we'll get rewards for this event. And I don't want to wait that long to get Space Millum, because I want to use her. Excuse me while I answer a question in Discord. Yes. We're going to change these. We're just going to unleash a whole set of attacks because we're going to orb change the blue just for funsies. And you're all going to die. You are all going to die. Max. Maximum points. Not very difficult at all. Ooh. We get matches tones too. Alright, cool. Alright, so max max. 
Yes, use stamina. Oh, okay, we have the little ticket counter up top as well. I have seven tickets so far. One turn again. Let's change these funny little orbs. You might take all four to actually die. Ooh, you might... Yeah. Ooh, you will take five attacks. Let's do that. Oh, oh. I have a terrible... I have a terrible habit of doing that, where I, I am clicking on the screen so fast and I hit go that I end up missing one of the orbs and it pisses me off every single time I do it because it's no one's fault but mine. <sighs> Such is life. He's dead anyway. Oh my god. There. You only get one attack. You you get disrespect. How dare you survive that? How dare you? Okay. Okay. So we definitely get milestone rewards. So 1,200, 3,000 gets you the octogram emblems. And do we, do we do anything with these? Is that a thing? Like, what do we do with those coins? I'll have to look it up. What are we at? 180,000. Cool. Sorry about my incessant typing. I'm trying to answer a few questions as well. Okay, this is another one person battle. I don't know if you'll die though. Yeah, you will definitely die. Give me those alts. Want to see some flashy animations? Or just give me Beretta stuff. <laughs> or counters. Have I ever mentioned that I hate counters in this game? I absolutely despise counters. Take them away. I don't want them. I don't want the enemy to have them. It does not help me at all. It has never helped me in a conquest battle. It always screws me over in conquest battles. It always screws me over in difficult events. I despise counters. Stop killing my units when I can't even see your rate. If you could show me your counter rate, fine, because some people have skills to lower counter rates. Cool. Hakuro has it, I think. Green Hakuro. Because I feel like the the current con the event conquest for the Maiden Tempest event, I feel like he counters every other attack. Sometimes he counters every one of my attacks. And I lose my damn mind every single time. I do not enjoy it. I want it gone. Or show me show me the enemy stats. Brenda's actually taking damage. Why why is she taking damage? Hey, you know what? We're gonna do this and we're gonna have everyone's alt. Almost everyone's alt. Brett will probably have well. Do that, do that, do that, do that. Okay, well we'll have two alts. For three units next turn. Actually, and Brett is an AoE. Mm, is Brett an AoE? She, no, she is single target as well. All right, well, we're still gonna launch a full six rounds because you're dead and you're dead and then whoever survives should also be dead. I don't care who, we're gonna skip. I do like Milam's ult though. I'm going to watch this one. It's so very flashy. Do, 
Just this, this end screen of destruction right here. She's just floating there. Yeah, I like that screen. 11,000. And you're dead. All right, cool. Damage received score. Oh! No, we have to come back and do it. Well, this is just the run. This is the first run through. When we, uh... After this, I'll go back in and I'll fix that score. Real fast. This should be the last stage. They've all been two. And then we can fight Gazel Dwargo. See how actual actually difficult he is since the dark bands are still up i feel like they'll make him you know slightly difficult because they would want to entice you to summon on the dark banners to get these units to do damage against him do well hmm maybe instead of rimuru i should bring trainee to heal that way my Damage at the end of the... Oh, guards. Stop that. My damage at the end of the turn... Wow, you didn't die. Damage at the end of the turn is less. How dare you. Yeah, look at... Look at that. Actually taking damage. And... You're, you're gonna get ulted. And then we're just gonna try and kill you. I don't know if he'll die from this super. <laughs> you, know, you won't die from this super. You should die. There you go. Alright, 913. 1400 on blues. What was that? What was this debuff? Attack down? Guard rate and attack by 20%. Alright, well, let's do that. Let's do this. Mm. Oh, no, I don't have enough. Oh, right. I took him off anyways. Never mind. You're dead anyways. Disappear. Are you kidding me? Fuck your guard. Oh, fuck your guard. Be gone. Be gone from my sight. Immediately. I probably should switch out and have Trainee on here just so we can heal up that damage. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Or is it... It's not remaining health. It is just how much damage you actually took. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I should put... No, because if it's not counting ending HP... Oh, there's a third one. Interesting. Okay. Wait. It's the same difficulty. Who am I fighting? Oh, I'm just fighting a monster. Okay. Top 64.4%. Oh. No. Okay. Let's see how hard this little beastie is. Then we can do a run on Gazel Dorgo, and we will call that a video. Haven't been too animated. It 10.43, just got off work. I apologize. I should be talking a lot more. I'm just so drained from talking to people at work, and I don't like that. I don't want to talk to you. Go away, please. Just let me do my job. All right, a bunch of greens. Hmm, seems like Beretta and Benny Mario are doing equivalent damage right here. Do I use the blues or do I use the millums? I think I use the millums. Hold on, hold on, hold on, no. 
Damn it. It's actually not what I wanted to happen. I wanted that other blue to change. That other blue melon. But we're still going to use all the melons. Get her ult. We still got the Orca Disaster skill next turn as well. Not that it's going to matter, because I'm going to nuke the crap out of him. Just for funsies. I don't have enough skill points. Never mind. We're just going to lower his defense. And then we'll do that. Yeah. He should be dead. It should be dead. After these attacks. Yes. Excellent. Just like I planned. Still getting S ranks. I don't like not seeing the, the max score there, but we will have to make do. Alright, do we move on to Gazzledorgo now? Yes, we do. Alright, how many tickets does it take? One ticket. Oh, <laughs> okay. Boss battle one. I feel like his armor looks much better. Also, I feel like my Milam could have a higher attack stat. Mm. You know what? I think we're going to do... We are going to put Raymaru on here. Is Raga going to give him a better overall EP? Probably not. And then we can throw... Yeah, Diablo right there. Did we get anything buffed out of that? Not really. Okay. Penny Mario, your attack stat looking pretty low right now. What is going on? You have your equipment on. That's just because he's a four-star unit. All right. Well, let's move out. 287 now. We have the alt buffer with Veldora. We have the attack buffer with Rimuru if we want to go either route. If we have a whole round of Milim cards, then I might just pull out Rimuru and use the damage buff. Take him down pretty fast. Very interested to see how much health you have. 22,000. Okay. Do we change those now? Or do we just kind of run? We're getting blues in the back there. Yeah, we'll go ahead and change now. Change now! How much? Oh, yeah, okay, bye-bye. Obviously the first fight, not the last fight. 389. Definitely not. You're dead here. There you go. Get him. Get him, Beretta. Okay, well, yeah. So far, this is a pretty bog-standard fight. 10,000 max, 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 max. 30, 30k score right there. How many boss battle fights are there? I think is the bigger question. 200k EP now requirement. He had 22,000 health to begin with, and we are now sitting, or he is now sitting at, does he have an aura now? Did he have an aura the last fight? I don't remember that. He now has 72,000. That is quite a jump. Okay. Let's change those. Change, okay, you're just going to change hers. All right. Dink, 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 and dink. It's a decent amount of HP gone. Oh, the counters! You get those away from me right now. Full hand, almost full hand of greens. Let's do that. 1100, 1200. Hmm. Why do I feel like Benny Mario is just doing less damage than he should? Normally my Beretta is the weaker one. I mean, yeah, I got one dupe for her, but it, it's only one dupe. Mm, oh. <laughs> the bane of my existence right now. The bane of my existence in this game. You mother...
How dare. All right, well, we're gonna get Beretta's ult. I know, well, because I could change all these and I could use them and I can get two ults in a row. We're just gonna do that. We don't get any damage out of it, but we sure are gonna get ults out of it. We might get everyone's ult. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. So, I feel like Benny Marv's not doing a lot of damage right now. But also, Beretta only has... Beretta only has the one attack card. And why is her orange card sealed on the next turn? I don't like that. Let's do this. And we're going to buff the alts. And we're going to lower defense. And we're going to up my own crit rate. We're just going to buff the crap out of this. And we're going to try to annihilate you on this turn. I don't care how much health you have. He's probably not going to die, It's if we're being realistic here. 14,000. It's not... Not enough. You should do 18, probably? You are level 100 milim. 22! I will take that. He didn't die. Ugh, get away from me. Oh my god. Incoming stun attack anticipated. Alright. We change orange to blues. You should be dead here. Yes, you are dead here. I hate counters. Oh my god. How dare you. How dare you counter me twice in a row and lower my health. Oh you, yeah, you give me that S rank. G damn it. Okay. Is there another fight after this? There is boss battle EX. 260k EP. Current rank 961. Where will I sit after I beat this here? Who knows? Nobody knows. I am going to test out after this uh, this video and do a run and see if, if I heal with trainee, will it deduct those damage points? Or does it just keep a running tally? I will find out for you. And let you know. And make a video on it, because why not? It's content. So sue me. Okay. We've got... Big Daddy Gazzle. I guess he always had the aura, and I just didn't notice in the first fight. Okay. We got Milum cards coming... I don't really want to change, so I'm just going to use these two. Oh, yeah, how much health do you have now? You had 22, then 77, 115. It's not as drastic as a jump as the first one was. Look at all these Millen cards. Please change all these Millen orbs. Yeah, well... You almost did. Good enough, though. Nineteen hundred. Wow. Twenty-one hundred. Is Beretta just straight up doing more damage? Is that a thing? Wow. You really don't give me any of the bar, do you? All right. Well, whatever. Wait. If I do this, okay, yeah. Yes. We're gonna do this. We're gonna use this one blue soul. We're gonna get the Benny Maru green soul next. We have enough to use the Orc of Disaster the turn after. Oh, he has guard up. It's his defense is going away. What 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 buffs does he have? Enemy with significant counterattack rate increase. 
defense by 100%. P attack by 5, like pierce? Is that what that is? Counter attack rate by 100%. So he is guaranteed to counter attack. Cool. Alright. Um, I'm going to change out Benny. Ooh, well. How long is his counter attack up for? Just one. Maybe it's better if I just. Alt? Do I alt? Um, like I really don't want to do anything here, actually, because he just he won't take damage. So my best bet is to just use a, a wa like waste a card. I'm just gonna use you, and you're gonna get counterattacked. But you know we'll deal with that. Yep, and there's the counter. And there's some smacks. Okay. His defense. Okay. Incoming stun. One remaining turn. Defense by 50%. Pierce resistance by 50%. Incoming stun attack. And we can stun. Evade here. We're going to switch out Benny Maru now for Rimaru. And we're going to use the damage boost to try and get around his defense buff. 3,000, 4, yeah, 4,900. 18,000 critical weak point. And then we've got the single alt coming in. Another 22K? Let me see it. 21, close. And Reamer is done because he didn't get that evasion on him. That's fine. Um, we're going to use more Milim cards and just try and get her ult again. <laughs> oh my god. I'm definitely not going to get the S rank on this because of just the sheer amount of damage that I've taken. Remir, you're going to get out of there now. What's this? Guard penetration, pierce rate, defense down, crit rate, orb changing. Wish I had the Orca Disaster right now, but I don't. We're going to lower his defense a little bit. And we're going to do this. And another counter. Ooh, ooh, I need to kill you here, huh? I need to kill you here. Who has a Muslim? So we got greens, so... I'm gonna swap Beretta for Veldora now. We're gonna use the super attack boost. And we're going to pray that this kills him. I think it should. It's going to do probably 22k again, unless I get a crit and it'll do more. Do it. 25. Okay, so there we go. There is the EX clear. And we got, <laughs> and we got a B rank. All right, well, well, we'll work on that. Where do I, where do I currently sit in the placement? Insufficient tickets, right? Rank 340, top 2.3%. And what is the top top ranking score? Uh, reward, top 0.1 to 5%. Okay, so if we can sit here, we will get, we will be fine. So I'll keep playing this. I'll try and get my score up, see how high we can place on this uh, this ranking. But for now, that is that. So I hope you guys have some luck on here. If you pulled on the Dark Banners, good. Use those teams. Let me know how you do. Let me know what your rank is. See if you can try and beat me. And I hope you guys have a good night. Take it easy. And I'll see you later.